Right, next letter. With so many different churches conducting different rituals for having a funeral, what does God say about the way a proper funeral should be held in accordance with him? Where in the Bible can I find scriptures that discuss this? And are there any rituals that are going on in so-called Christian churches that would be against what the Bible teaches about funerals? Why, certainly. Amen. Amen. First and foremost, Amen. funerals is not even in the Bible. Not in, the Bible. Not in there, sir. That's right. Not in there. Funerals are a custom that people have. Amen. Amen. That's all it is. Nothing more, nothing less. That's right. But a custom. That's, That's all. In the Bible day, all they did was took you and buried you. Okay. That's right. And, Acts? and when they did gather around you, they gathered while you was being buried. That's, That's right. right. You better That's give right. me the book of Samuel, Samuel if I'm correct. First Samuel chapter That's 25. Right. Follow me. And begin at verse 1. Yeah. And Samuel died. Samuel died. And all the Israelites were gathered all together. All the Israelites gathered together. And, lam and lamented him. They cried. And buried him. And buried him. In his house. In his house. At Ramah. At Ramah. Amen. Amen. Only time they gathered was a burying taking yeah, place. That's, that's right. right. So funerals is not in the Bible. That's uh, right. Is it is a custom that people have. Now, you ask if there are rituals that go on in churches that's Why, contrary certainly. to the Bible? Certainly. Why, Lord, yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> now, let's get back to funerals mm -hmm. and let's tie in masonry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because masonry brings their rituals in the churches. That's Amen. right. When a mason died in some old false church. That's right. The masons come in with their little aprons on and Slow. gloves and That's big gold chunky looking stuff <laughs> That's right. around That's their right. neck and they go That's to right. the head of the dead fellow mason uh -huh. and ring little bell. Little I don't bell. know why they ring it. I haven't That's got that far in advance right. of my studies of mason rack. That's right. <laughs> but they go to the head of the dead uh, uh -huh. one and yeah. ringing bells and they march around it and do little moves. Uh -huh. That's right. That's vain. vain. That's right. God, vain. if they didn't repent of their sins and obey God, then they're going to hell. No, That's all. So yes. Ring all the bells and wear all the gloves that you want. That's right. Mm -hmm. Now, when they have funerals in the churches, one of the greatest lies, That's mm -hmm. God. one of the greatest lies in a funeral That's right. is that your mama going to heaven. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. That's right. And your daddy is in heaven waiting on your mama. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> That's what they say. Did you hear what I said? Yes, Amen. sir. Amen. One of the greatest lies Amen. is that your mama is going to heaven. Uh huh. When your daddy's already there, already waiting there. for mama to arrive. That's right. That's right. When anyone dies. That's right. <laughs> when anybody dies, you're buried. That's buried. right. That's it. Spirit. You ain't going to heaven. The only thing that come out of you is your spirit. spirit. And right. In Ecclesiastes right. chapter 12 and at verse 7. And your spirit is not going to heaven. No, oh, no. That's right. That's right, sir. God, if your time filled me to break into that. That's right. Amen. Amen. But listen at the scripture. In Ecclesiastes 12 and verse 7. Oh, then shall the dust return to the earth as it was. Shall the dust return to the earth where it's at. And the spirit shall return unto God who gave it. Oh, I'm saying, well, God is in heaven. Everywhere. God is everywhere. It's everywhere. everywhere. When the Bible said it returns to God, that means it go back in God's presence. That's, That's right. Where is God? Everywhere. everywhere. That's everywhere. right. Before for heaven and earth. Amen. Amen. So when it go to God, it go right in the presence of God. That's, That's right. It. Not just in one location. It goes in the presence of God, and God is everywhere. That's right. Do you understand? That's Amen. right. The spirit is not local. That's right. No, it's not. No, it's not. Flesh is local. That's, That's right. right. That's, That's right. right. Excellent. Go ahead. Excellent. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm filming it. I can do that. That's right. You may ask, do we have funerals? No, we don't have them. No. Will you go preach to a at a funeral? Someone yes. asks. Yes, yes, I will go. Oh, well, yes. Why would you go? Because, even if it's not in the Bible. The well, I go to a Baptist church to preach the truth. That's right. Yet That's right. that church is not in the Bible. That's, That's right. right. I'm not going to a funeral to preach to the dead, yet That's I am right. talking to the dead. That's right. That's right. That's it, Pops. Living dead. That's right. Living dead. That's right. We're here. That's right, Pop. We're here. Excellent. Excellent. I'm not talking to the dead that's laid out in the casket. No, no. But there's a living dead. Living dead. That's right. That's right. And I'll go talk to those living dead. That's right. That's right. Dead while she lives. That's right. Because she that lives in pleasure. Dead while she lives. And dead while she lives. Dead while That's she right. Lives. Excellent. Well, said, but you don't have funerals. No. And you will go to one and preach. Yes. Yeah, well, sir. Oh, yeah. Well, I'd go to anything and preach. That's, That's right. right. Uh -huh. I oh, became yeah. all yeah. things. I'd go to anything. The oh, Bible says. I became all oh, yeah. things. Notice chapter and verse. First Corinthians 9, beginning verse 20. What is it? And unto the Jews I became as a Jew. Wonderful. I became as a Jew. Listen, yes, mm -hmm. my natural nationality, I'm not Jewish. Amen. Oh, no. Thank God, but I put on a hat. That's right. 
That's right. That's right. Oh, yeah. And I fall on the wall sharp. That's Amen. right, sir. And I step in the synagogue and kiss the Torah. That's, That's right. right. Preach Christ, sir. And preach Christ. That's, That's right. right. Certainly, sir. One. Unto the Jews. Yes, sir. Oh, and oh yeah. Amen. Yes, sir. I'm not a Muslim. Oh, no. Go ahead. Oh, sir. But if the invitation presents itself, I'll go to the mosque, That's right. the mosque, and take my shoes off. That's right. That's right. With the scriptures. Sir. That's, That's right. right, sir. Excellent, sir. Go ahead. Certainly, I Certainly, will. Sir. Go ahead. Go ahead. All things. That's right. And take the Quran. Amen. 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 And from the Quran, preach Jesus. That's right. Go ahead. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. From all things. That's right. All things. That's but right. to have that skill, you That's must right. be able, able with a divine know how. That's right. That's true. That's right. To become all things. To become all things. That's right. To become all things. To all men. Yeah, all so right. to the Muslims. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'll become a Muslim. A Muslim. A Muslim. That's right. Go ahead. To gain it. To gain the Muslim. The Muslim. That's, That's right. right. That's yes, right. For the Jew, That's right. I'll become a Jew. A Jew. Jew. That's Jew. right. To gain yes, sir. the Jew Amen. to the Buddhist. Hallelujah. Go ahead. Yes, sir. Go ahead. I'll yes, become sir. a monk. Amen. That's right. My Lord. To gain the, the Buddhist. Yes, That's sir. right. Wonderful. That's right. Amen. I have yes, made all things. Amen. Do you hear what the apostle said? First Corinthians Amen. 9 and verse 22. I have made all so things. So to the funeral believer. Uh -huh. Amen. All things. I'll get in the funeral line. That's right. Drive Amen. with you, sir. Drive right I'll with you. I'll turn my headlights on. That's right. Amen. That's I'll up. put the label of funeral on my car. That's, That's right. right. Amen. Go ahead. Because I know my time. That's right. We'll come. It's, it's will come. That's, That's right. When I can resurrect you from the dead. That's, That's right. right. Go ahead. Amen. Go ahead. Excellent. Go ahead. Beautiful. Excellent, Amen. Excellent. Are you listening? Amen. Excellent. Glory to God. Excellent. Next letter. Hallelujah. Sir, an email says, I'm writing for understanding. I have, All right. I have recently received one of your tapes. I'm truly a believer in God and your, and your teachings. Mm -hmm. I am divorced. My wife divorced me because she said God called her to be a preacher. Mm -hmm. My understanding and teachings is that God has not appointed a woman for that. Mm -hmm. What do I do? I live, he says, where he lives. I want to be part of your environment. Your teaching is what I know. The sermon you taught and spoke about the donkey or an ass in the book of Numbers was so uplifting. I called my mother in North Carolina. She expanded it with her. I have two children, but my wife divorced me, and I didn't, I didn't know what to do because I don't believe in divorce. I couldn't divorce her. Exactly. Scriptures don't allow now that she has divorced me. Does this set me free? No, I don't. Amen. No. Amen. If she divorced you, mm -hmm. she's not free. Amen. That's right. All she did was went through a formality. That's right. That's all. She's free by the law of the land. That's Amen. right. By the law of God. In Romans no. chapter 7, beginning right. verse 1. You see? God versus Caesar. That's right. That's right. Oh, yeah. Render to God the things that are God, render to Caesar the things that are Caesar. That this is comply with what I was talking about earlier. Really, that's Amen. right. Caesar allowed remarriage and divorce. Yes, he does, sir. That's right. Government allowed remarriage and divorce. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Government condoned it. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. But their law mm -hmm. is a direct challenge to God's law. That's right. that's right. Now, let's see what God's law said. In Romans chapter 7, beginning verse 1. All right. Know ye not, brethren, for I speak to them that know the law. Yeah. How that the law hath dominion yes. over man as long as he liveth. Uh -huh. For the woman which hath an husband, the woman that have a husband is bound by the law to her husband. Bound by the law to her husband. That's right. So long as he liveth. Now your wife divorced you, she's still bound. That's, That's right. right. Oh yeah. I don't care what lawyer that went with her and judged what he granted, mm -hmm. she's bound. Amen. Amen. Because you was alive. That's right. Wasn't alive, you wouldn't wrote me. That's right. <laughs> alive. And she's still bound. That's Amen. right. Listen. For the woman which hath an husband is bound by the law to her husband. All right. So long as she liveth. All right. But if the husband be dead. If the husband is dead. She is loosed from the law of her husband. So in order for you to be free, sir, your wife got to die. That's, That's right. right. In order for your wife to be free, you got to die. Mm -hmm. That's right. Now, if you want to get involved with a woman, why are you divorced? Mm -hmm. The 
only leverage you got is go back to the same one that divorced you. In 1 right. Corinthians chapter 7. That's right. Listen. And begin right. at verse 10. You can't get no new meat. Oh, That's right. No. You got to go back to the turkey that divorced you. That's right. That's right. Yes, yes sir. If the turkey don't want you, you can't get a leg of chicken. No, no. <laughs> Am I right? Amen. Amen. Can't do that. No, That's right. no. Not you, allowed you can't switch meat. No, sir. No, no, sir. No, no. Stop, stop, no. Stop, stop it. Huh? That's Amen. right. Come on, sir. First Corinthians 7, beginning <laughs> verse 10. <laughs> yeah. And unto the married I command, yet not I but the Lord. What is it? Let not the wife depart from her husband. All That's right, right, all right. Don't let the wife leave her husband. But... But and if she depart, if she do leave, let her remain unmarried. But suppose you want to get him now. Your wife, who divorced you and left you, she's not allowed to marry no more. Because the Bible said if she goes, she got to remain unmarried. Unmarried. Right. And if she want to get involved with the man, right what did the Bible say? Or be reconciled to her husband. You got to get rid of those divorce papers and come on back to you. That's, That's right. right. So right. you're still bound, and the thing you got to do, even if she don't want to get involved with you, now you're going to take your mind, soul, body, and spirit and turn it over to the boss. Amen. That's right. And that's God himself. That's right. All right, next letter. 